Hey guys, welcome to another writing vlog. This is me taking my laptop out of a drawer. It's been a long time since I've actually written, so the laptop had been put away for a little while. I was actually inspired to write. I've been thinking about a new story. It's a nonfiction, which I'm really happy about, so I just went for it. So I opened up my word program and started writing and everything was going pretty well for a little while as far as the writing part was concerned, but my laptop was not cooperating with me. So this is me having a meltdown because I felt like I finally sat down to work and now my computer was giving me all kinds of problems and all it was as we had it at my computer had updated to Windows 11 and we were trying to get it back to Windows 10 so it could work but it didn't work out in the end it was just not working out so we left it at Windows 11 but I decided to take a little break and have a snack and just go also to go over some of the notes that I had written uh, regarding the new book that I'm writing so it was just a nice little break instead of crying and freaking out and giving up I decided to just refocus and just focus on the things that I actually wanted to do and then I got to writing By this time it was nearly lunchtime so I went ahead and took a break but I wanted to show you today's weather. You guys let me know if you do this too but I was so excited about the words that I had just written that I couldn't keep it to myself I was like I need to share this so I called my husband in and I read the 1200 words to him because I just needed to share let me know if you've done this before and he loved it and that made me really happy so what I'm doing here now is um, I don't know if you guys saw my last video but I did a verse mapping word and it was purpose I wanted to do it again I did verse mapping faith because I want to just really really understand the meaning of faith and I know that at the surface we all understand what faith means but this is the purpose of verse mapping is to really Really get in the word and really understand all the things all the topics that maybe we don't quite understand or the topics that are pressing in our hearts right now and that's why I love this process so much so before getting back to my writing I sat down on my kitchen table and I verse mapped the word faith
so I actually never got back to writing so here we are the next day a storm happened again it's pretty normal in the summertime in Florida to be raining almost every single day and it was the perfect time to get cozy with coffee and this coffee donut and that is one of my favorite I don't like donuts but I love those little coffee cake donuts that they sell at our grocery store in Publix one of my favorites so I got myself a coffee and a donut and I just enjoyed the rainy afternoon for a minute I was watching YouTube before I got to writing again also you guys I picked up this Bible coffee table book at Barnes & Noble it is absolutely beautiful it was only $15 and the pictures inside are absolutely gorgeous so I just wanted to show you guys in case this is something you guys are looking for or interested in you can pick it up at Barnes & Noble for $15 So I'm finally getting to some writing and spoiler alert, this writing session went really well. I got a bunch of words down and I'm really happy about it because I didn't know if I was actually going to be able to sit down and actually write if I had another book in me. You guys know what it's like to doubt yourself after you finish one book and then months go by before you actually get another word down makes you nervous you start thinking am I not able to write again but I do this between every single book so I know that for now that I will be able to write but I do want to inspire you guys or remind you guys that writing shouldn't be so much pressure <laughs> let yourself off the hook and write for the fun of it write out of inspiration don't write because you are pressured by the industry or by your audience or by your readers really write because you are a writer and you are inspired to write this beautiful story that you have in your heart to put out into the world well you guys that is it for this writing vlog I did get a ton of words down as you saw and I think I got a little more than what I show here so if you want more writing vlogs make sure you check out this vlog right here